Welcome to an MTD CNC technical corner. Today we're building, we're putting a full kitchen, aren't we, Dion? Um, we're talking about a, a product called Cabinet Vision, um, which helps people, manufacturers, woodworking manufacturers, make and design full kitchens for for customers, for end users. <laughs> First of all, what, how do people design kitchens? What kind of software do they use and what challenges do they face? Yeah, so Cabinet Vision, what I'm, I'm here to speak about today, um, is a, it's a design to manufacture tool. So we, what we tend to find in our industry is customers, to, they're, they're selling directly to residential clients and they need a tool to um, help the customer visualize exactly what they're gonna deliver. Um, so we, our Cabinet Vision provides that platform, so you can design a kitchen, do the floor plan, uh, drop your cabinets in and really dress up a room so visually the customer can, can see what they're going to get. Um, what we tend to find is in our industry there's, there's software that will offer this, the design side of it, um, but then it sort of breaks down towards the manufacturing side and that's why Cabinet Vision is really unique. So we can take that design that you've done for your customer, you've won the order, and we can automatically generate ports, send out uh, information to the CNC machine, so then parts can be manufactured straight away. Absolutely, I've never seen in, in any industry, in engineering, metalworking, we know quite well, um, I've never seen this piece of software that can do straight from design all the way to quoting and programming the, the, the program itself. So let's dig into the actual process, how you yeah. actually do it. We'll start with the start, which is design of the kitchen. Um, what, what are the advantages of, of Cabinet Vision over a product design suite? Yeah, so there's lots of tools on the market, um, lots of design tools, but what makes us unique is we're, we're actually, there's a layer behind the design, so we're actually adding in the manufacturing information. So Cabinet Vision's built on essentially data and parametric rules. So as a manufacturer, you'll use, you offer certain materials, uh, you'll use certain hinges or draw, uh, draw runners, and um, you can build all that information into Cabinet Vision in the background so that when you're doing the design, as you're bringing in cabinets, modifying cabinets, you can, um, it, the, the system's automatically understanding and knowing how you want to manufacture that. So rather than doing the design, winning the order, and then having to work out how it's manufactured after, um, Cabinet Vision will already have that information in the, it already in the process. So it's already building that information up. So essentially doing the design in Cabinet Vision will then reduce the steps you have to do after to, um, to get it to the shop floor. And, and we've, talk, we've talked previously about the need for woodworking in general to be producing components all the time, keeping those machines up. So yeah. if, the, the, if the programs are already programmed before some, once someone's finished the design, it helps make sure that those, those machines are gonna stay up and running as much as possible. Yeah. Um, and there's so many com little complicated bits to it, even just a set of drawers, the door hinges, the runners. Uh, if you did that in a, in a normal CAD system, I guess you might have to remember to update every little thing if something changes and things can change in the over the course of designing a kitchen yeah yeah no exactly that so there's there's lots of cad software out there um, lots of powerful cad software um, but cabinet vision is purely geared to cabinet manufacture so um, if you had a generic cad system you could design pretty much anything you wanted in there but actually it's not uncommon for someone to do a design for their customer that customer wants something changing and if they have to change it, the, the, the company will have to go back and remember to change every component associated to that cabinet. Whereas Cabinet Vision, because it's parametric, so if you are add, adding in an additional shelf, it will know exactly uh, where it needs to be positioned, uh, any machinable holes next to that that um, are being positioned on the parts as well. So it's automatically applying all that information without you having to remember it. So it removes that human error uh, side of the the software absolutely hopefully increases improves the quality quality of your product yeah. and reduces, your, reduces your scrap rate um once you've uh, designed the kitchen the customer said yeah I'll, i want this it's great um it could the customer can be quoted so, uh, we could do full job costings from the design uh, because it is a, a data driven bit of software um, we can put in our our pricing by material by parts uh, we can really get into the detail so from that design again we can easily produce a quotation that the um the, the, our user can send to their client um, without having to take it elsewhere, put it into another bit of software and get a quote, a quote from a different platform. So it's all built into, into the same area. Um, but from there, we can also produce stuff like material summary reports. So for instance, if, if, uh, if our customer wanted to know how much material they needed to order for this particular job, 
or check they've got it in stock, you can quickly produce a material summary report to, to get that information. Absolutely, and it's it's, it's fascinating that you, that you mentioned silos. People generally have software for this, yeah. software for that, software for, for something else. This is one piece of software yeah. can do all of this. Leading us on to manufacture, um, which is the, the parts, you mentioned they're already programmed, the part, components are already programmed in the design phase. Um, but there's different ways to manufacture it. You could have people with CNC machines, with manual machines. How can you handle these different situations? Yeah, so we have customers um, that don't have always have CNC machines. So it might be manual machinery with um, people on the shop floor. So they need to feed that information to the guys on the shop floor. And again, like we can with our uh, quotation side, we can automatically generate cut lists for the shop floor uh, for assembly sheets or, or panel stock cut lists. So we can detail what parts are needed, the sizes, and then that information uh, can be used on the shop floor to manually cut it. Um, but we also can automate, um, so we can send cut lists to say uh, beam saws, so NC controlled saws. We can provide cut lists to them, what get fed in, optimized, and then automatically cut as well. And then from the CNC point of view, we, I mean, we're a universal uh, program. We've, Cabinet Vision's been around for over 40 years now. It's all, it's global. So we've worked with lots of different machine tool suppliers linked to lots of CNC machines. So we can take that design because we've got all the information in the background. We can then automatically break it down into a part list and then say nest it out on a router. So there's no manual intervention. Someone hasn't got to look at that design and then work out how they got a machine or put it onto a machine to be nest. So you can literally just from a click of a button, take that design, break it down and send it through to be machined. So just sending a program to the shop floor. Brilliant. So for the cabinet makers out there, for the kitchen manufacturers out there, um, if they're interested in the product now, how can they get in touch? So yeah, you can find us on um, hexagon.com. Uh, you can find information about uh, cabinet vision and there is a contact, us, uh, a contact sales page from there that people can get in touch. You know, the local representative uh, make on. <music>